What is up everybody, it's Josh at the Card Library and today we have a opening of a couple of Sword and Shield tins. These are my first time getting, uh, opening and, well, buying and opening these tins. Um, so I'm pretty excited to see what's on the inside. They, they redid the shape of these, which is pretty cool, I guess. You know, I, I always, I buy a lot of tins, but I don't do anything with the tins themselves. They take up a lot of room. I think the elite, the elite trainer boxes are way better at storage. So I don't really keep the tins. If anyone has any like suggestions for what to do with the tins, um, that would be great. Leave it in the comments. Uh, so we have uh, Zemazenta here, a very nice V card, um, a promo, very nice. Uh, and then looks like we got four packs. We have a couple of Rebel Clash packs. Um, a, bur ooh, a Burning Shadows and an Evolutions pack. So we have some Charizard possibility here. Um, okay, so we'll just get a, go ahead and start these. We'll start with the Rebel Clash packs. Um, uh, I just wanted to thank everyone who stuck it for the long haul for my last video, the 60 uh, packs of Burning, uh, or excuse me, of Hidden Fates. That was a long one. So <laughs> I think I'm making a conscious effort here to um, have a slightly shorter video today. So we're gonna do the two tins. We got Creepy Mr. Mime, Snover, Bit of, that guy, this guy, that guy, and a big garbage can on the end. Uh, yeah, so I love these old packs. Part of me wants to, to keep, a, a keep some of the Burning Shadows pack sealed. Um, just because I think there's going to be a lot of value in them later. And I have a couple of the hyper rare Charizards already. Um, so, you know, but for the channel, I think we'll just continue to open them because people want to see that pulled live. Um, and that would be a super cool thing to pull on the channel. So uh, at least for now, um, we will keep opening these packs. Uh, this is base set Sword and Shield. I flipped my camera around, so I don't know. I'm just trying a couple different things with the camera angle. So let's see how this goes. I think this might actually be way better, this this angle. Um, heat more, Ghastly. This guy. Oh, I just, oh, that's right. That's what I want to talk about. I just bought a Pokemon Shield for my Switch. So I'm pretty excited to get to know all these new Pokemon. Um, here we go, Burning Shadows. You know, I, I wish they said their names out loud because that's what I struggle with. I don't know their names. I can't say their names, which is not great for the channel, but you know, we'll get there. Uh, one, two, three, four to the front. We have Steel, a Steel Energy to start, Gloom, Seedra, Bodybuilding Dumbbells, Noibat, Pikachu, Esper, Pansage, Meryl, Dusclops, and on the end we have an Arachnid. So, so far this tin has been a complete and total bust. Not one uh, EX, GX, none of it. Um, so, let's see. Here we go. And I think it's just one, two, three with this. So, okay, we have a Porygon, a De-Evolution Spray, Nidorino, a Dark-type Energy, Vulpix, Nidoran, Ponyta, Pikachu, a reverse hollow Caterpie, and on the end we have an Electrode. Yeah, so we pulled nothing from that Zemazenta tin. Um, not a single card of value. Uh, the promo is the most valuable card on that tin. Uh, so that that's that's uh, sometimes that's just part of the game. All right, hold on. Let's here. Come on. Oh, the whole thing came out. Okay. All right, so this is the promo card. Whoa, sorry guys. Beautiful card there. A Cinderace, a Cinderace V. Very, very nice full art. And then for the packs, we have Sword and Shield, Sword and Shield, Shield, Cosmic Eclipse, Burning Shadows and Evolutions again. Okay, okay. So we might have a chance, guys. We, we Hopefully this, this um, let's start in the reverse order this time. We'll start with Evolutions. Um, yeah, basically anything is going to be better than that first tin. So, <laughs> so let's see what we've got here. One, two, three to the front. We have a de-evolution spray, a Metapod, Professor Oak's Hint, Magnemite, Voltorb, 
Sandshrew, a Poliwag, a Diglett, ooh, a nice foil energy, and on the end we have a Mewtwo. So I guess we get a foil energy, which is better than nothing. All right, here we go, Burning Shadows. I think with Burning Shadows, it's literally Hyper Rare Charizard or Bust at this point. I, I don't think, I think it's a pretty bad set other than that. Um, so we'll see what we get. We have a Dark Energy, a Super Scoop Up, an Electabuzz, a Sophilis, a Charmander, a Porygon, a Meryl, a Hoot Hoot, Rhyhorn, a Reverse Hollow Raichu, and on the end we have a Vile Bloom. So we did get a, a foil in that rare spot, but nothing to write home about again. All right, we got Cosmic Eclipse. First Cosmic Eclipse pack of the video. Um, I, I, you know, Cosmic Eclipse has been a great set, I believe. You know, I, I think. I think uh, there's been a lot of good cards in that um, that have like retained their value. So let's see what we can do. Uh, we have a Dark Energy, a Tag Call, a Dartrix, Lily's Full Force, Woobat, Ducklet, Swirlix, Alolan Grimer, Slugma, a Reverse Hollow Bell Ball, and Bryce Man, and an Emplon. So nothing. We got nothing again. Um, all right, so it's all of the sword and shield and we want those gold cards out of here. So let's see if anything can happen uh, to, to end this video off something uh, slightly exciting. One, two, three, four to the front. We have a steel type energy, a switch, a ferrothon, a rabbit, a galarian zigzagoon, a mananana, a snananana, a grookey, a shelter, a chinchu choo choo, and a Gengar. That's a cool card. I mean, I don't think it's worth any money, but it's cool. I mean, at this point in this video, we're just looking for cool stuff because we're not pulling anything. We're not pulling anything. All right, guys, this is the last pack. Um, thanks for hanging out today. One, two, three, four to the front. Like I said, we're going to do a shorter video today because the last one was um, like a 15-part series, a 40-minute opening. Uh, so let's... Uh, Let's see if we can't round uh, finish this off with something good. Oh, nice! And the last card is a Morpa Q V. So we we end with some last pack magic. Uh, this is a I actually this is a full art. This is a super good pull here. So um, thank you guys for hanging out with me today, um, and I'll catch you next time.